My name is Jimmy Dale of Jimmy Dale Custom Guitars, and I am hoping to have this finished by June for the anniversary of the Hot Shots. I have been building this guitar for the past two years. I was gonna donate it last year for June, and then this happened. Yeah. <laughs> I dropped it and the neck snapped off. Uh, so, I decided to go ahead and build a new Fireman's Axe for the Hot Shots. First one ever built, by the way. There's no one else has built a, a Fireman's Axe. This one is gonna go into my junk pile where I'm gonna make something out of it later. Uh, but I got a feeling that someone above, maybe 19 guys were saying, hey, you know what? This looks more like a Fireman's Axe than a Hot Shots Axe. So, I toss this to the side and started working on this, which hopefully should be done by June. This is the Hot Shot Axe. Trying to form this in the shape of a handle, give a little more of a different uh, look on there. I've got the threads to line up my bridge, by the way, which I've already done. One pickup, and I'm having a little special surprise for the pickup here. I'm not gonna tell you what it is, but it's gonna be really super cool. And of course, here's the blade, and this is gonna be shaved down to look like a natural blade. There's gonna be chrome on here, and on that, I'm gonna have the name of all the 19 firefighters with an RIP in there. Um, I'm gonna have some decoration up in here as well. And of course, here's the pickaxe. I glued this last night, trimmed it down, and now this whole guitar really is subject to uh, hand sanding. So that's where I'm gonna be at this point. And then also on the back, uh, I'm gonna have this all painted red, except for this cross right up in here. I really put that as purple heart. Uh, which symbolizes heroism, okay? And I'm just gonna have this painted red in the back. I'm just gonna have like a little bit of a, like a circle around here just to kind of give it a little more of a, of a poignant look to it on the back. Uh, and as you sit the guitar up, I purposely did it that way so the cross is right side up. That's really about it. And the only question I have is, you know, really, what band wants to play this on Whiskey Row when it comes to the anniversary of the Hot Shots because this is not a display guitar. I mean, you can display it, but you can play it too. So it's, it's getting there. It's getting there. But I think the boys up top are a little bit more happier with this one. Uh, although I did break this when it dropped. This is a dropping guitar. I don't know what's going on with this, but or I'm, maybe I'm just clumsy. But I did repair it, and as you can see, it kind of flares out too up in here. This is going to be, what I would have to say, pretty awesome. Um, this is what, March, about mid-March. So I've got about another month, two months, to get this put together and painted and finished and urethane and the whole nine yards. So anyway, Prescott, um, this is what I'm working on, and hopefully I should have this up there. Uh, really no later than mid-June and I'll be giving this to the uh, uh, to the hotshot uh, exhibit museum in the mall you have there too so I hope you like it I'm working hard on it it's a daily project for me and uh, I'm telling you this thing's gonna crank I've got EMG active pickups going in here I got it when I say active that means it's also powered by a battery which just BAM you know just gives it that punch which is, which is what I'm looking for. So I hope you like it. The Hot Shot Axe, I'm gonna name it up in here. It's gonna have the name uh, Dale Guitars and then Hot Shot, okay? Yeah, I hope you like it. This is for you guys. Yeah, it's just a way to remember them. It's just a way to remember them.